Hello guys, welcome back to Pause and welcome back to Parker Tech Campaign. Um, so it's been an absolute age since we've been in here, so I do apologise for that. But we are back in Adventure Island and we are going to continue on this campaign in this park. So our goals from God knows how long ago were have 500 guests in the park. We are about 250, so roughly halfway. And have a happiness rating of 57%, uh, sorry, 80%, and we're currently sat at 57%. And the optional is to do this by the end of December, year two. So it is raining, it's thundering, everything's closed, and my guests are not overly happy. Um, but we can make some changes and hopefully fix that. Now, the main issue this queue for this coaster here is causing people to really, really be annoyed because it's a long, long queue. So, what I'm going to do, first of all, is close that, because that queue is holding my, um, it's holding back my rating of niceness, or whatever, whatever I'm trying to say. Um, happiness rating, that's the badger. Yeah, it's sort of holding that back. So, I'm going to get rid of all this, which is really hard and annoying, so I didn't realise it was also structurally sound. Oh my god. Oh Jesus! Come on, come on! Yeah. Okay. Let's empty that out a little bit. Oh Christ! Um, let me think of a quicker way to get this queue on in here. Maybe we just take it straight down. I think it'd be quite good. It's just it's just too long. That is the only issue with it. It is too long. And I don't like it. Uh, the other thing we're probably gonna do in this episode is put in another coaster. So possibly we will put in um a loan. I think it would be good. To getting a new coaster in the parks. We need to bring people in, that's the issue. Um, if I just take that straight down like that, is that going to be too much? And then go down to there. Possibly could work. Yeah, let's try that. It's not much smaller, but it's slightly smaller. Okay, let's quickly put that fence back just so it looks like it's supposed to be there. There we go. Um, and then some cover on the path, and then that will do us slightly. I know it's only slightly smaller, don't worry. I'm hoping less people will join the queue. Let's use the wooden one. Okay, so guests are dropping like flies. I mean, we had up to 200 and odd before we started this. However, people come back in now because this coaster is open. So that's a big draw for that. Um, so, yeah, it's annoying that it's at the entrance too. But that's, that's, that's annoying because people are going to go straight to there. Uh, what else have we got going on here? Pair entrance deal was a good deal. Okay, we can trim that up a bit, I guess. Let's go to seven. Um... I feel we need some toilets down here at the entrance. So let's put them in. Uh, let's get rid of that tree first. So we don't really have many toilets. I think I have one in the park. So let's put that here. And then have a little, a little pathway up to that. And just put it behind a very quick wall and then we'll get cracking on some kind of new rides to hopefully get this park going in the right direction because at the moment it's not and then a lovely roof done <laughs> uh, right so let's have a look uh, we're definitely going to have to get a loan aren't we 
this part this portion of land here I think it looks good for a ride so let's see what we can afford oh we haven't got a drop tower actually that could be that could be nice uh, let's have a look at finances should we take a uh, oh I don't know five grand loan no no it's not to be nine grand to Okay, nine grand loan. Put this on here. I'm gonna put it twenty, whatever high. <laughs> Open. That's gonna get up to six quid. I think that's gonna be quite a good ride. That is. line can just go along here actually we'll go down a bit and then straight up to there and that's our queue line Yeah, they're kind of piling on this, aren't they? So let's make this a bit bigger. There we go. Okay, right. So we've got that. Um, people are still coming in. Coaster. Here. What coaster can we do? Vertical drop. Any of these can we afford? Answer is no. We can't afford those. Okay, no, no, neither. Let's see what else we can afford. What's the one we've already put in? Is it that one? No. Some of these are just terrible coasters. Like looking at them, they're pretty raw, pretty, pretty rubbish. Look. No, we could do a research more coasters, couldn't we, actually? Let's do that. Um, what else have we not put in? I think we've got everything else. Yeah, everything else we have so far, so... Or do we try and make our own coaster? I mean, I don't think that's going to work very well, but we could try it, wouldn't we? I'm not very good at doing coasters. <laughs> I'm really bad at them. Oh, yeah, this one's only 8,000. We can afford this one. We can find a place for it. Why is it going anywhere? Occupation. Uh, location. Is already occupied, it's not. Oh, that can go in. There we go. We've put a coaster in. I think that was a terrible idea. <laughs> I really do. But it's in now, so never mind, we'll have to live with that. Oh I don't have enough money. Okay. <coughs> Pardon me! I have loads of money. Right, let's get the entrance exit in. Uh, entrance... Oh, they're already there. Let's move them around this side. Entrance exit. Get that up to six quid for now. Get it tested. Oh, great. Just what we need. I'm hoping this will draw people in. It might not. We might just have failed this at this level, but, you know, it's worth going in. Come on, money. We could do with some money. It's very important we get money now. To put in this entrance. Otherwise, I'm not going to get any cash. Come on.
Okay, I'm kind of losing a lot of a lot of money at the moment, which is not good. Uh, what do the guests use? Okay, a lot of stuff's worth the money, but yeah, I'm not sure. So we see if we can put the price up this. See if that helps. It's still massive queue. Look at that, it's ridiculous. I'm going to put the price up for that as well. Yeah, that's really bad, that is. It's the throughput of the ride. They're so low capacity. Just nobody gets on them. Oh, God. Bankruptcy. Oh, God. Okay, I made a terrible mistake here. I don't think I should have took that loan out. Oh dear. Well, I think this was a fail. This might be the first part we end up failing, folks. Damn. Um. Oh, yeah. I probably shouldn't have took that. I'm having the other loan. <laughs> I'm being stupid about it. I'm going to take the other loan and try and get this oh no not there I'm going to try to get some people in just to get to this ride and then hopefully make a profit on it but it's not going to happen not going to happen at all eight right that's that now let's quickly pay back some other loans Oh, this is really bad. This is really bad. Let's pay four grand back of that. Okay. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> We've failed this so badly. Oh, no. That's, this is literally my only, my only shot at making this work. I know it was stupid. I know it was. There we go. We might just break even now with that. We might just do it. It's going to be close. <laughs> but if we can just about make back enough money to cover that cost we might just about do it let's put this up what are people saying park entrance feels a really good deal right that's going up even more let's put that up to nine because all these guests are coming in people are fl <laughs> they're not flooding in as much as I would hope if I'm being completely honest Come on, we'll just put a brand new coaster in, you fools. Get in. Get in me park. Oh, that's too, this is going to kill us, this. The happiness thing is really going to kill us. I don't know how we're going to get that up. Because we are nowhere near where we need to be. What are we? 58. We're nowhere near. Uh, right, research is done. You can go off for now. We need to save money. Need to save those sweet money dollars. Uh, let's put everything. Let's put all these up. Uh, what else we got? Information kiosk. One fifty, please. Okay, we're making a profit again now. That's good. That means we've done something there. That was very close to for being disastrous. That is. What's this? No dirtiness. Uh, clean, please. 450 for that. 450 for that. Okay. Okay, right, we're making money again. Let's pay off some more loan. Because we want to make rid of this thing here. Okay, that's gone. £1,000. So we still owe. What do we owe? Oh God, still owe like 10 grand. 
It's like real life. Um, okay. How's this doing? Are people liking it or what? what are they saying? Test flight was awesome. I can't afford it. Well, that's one person. I don't care. I'm not, I'm not here to make you happy. I am here to make them happy, actually. That is the entire point of this. Um, I want to go on top scan. Well, are they negative? Are these negatives? I don't know what these mean. Filthy park. Yeah, the people are definitely saying the park's not not very fun to walk around. So let's get a few more Jans. A few more Janets. They can clear up the place. Uh, and yeah, well, this is good. Look, we are making money. I'm, I'm actually really happy about this. I was genuinely panicking that this was going to be the first one we failed. Well, I say first one, I failed one already, but the first one recently that we failed. Uh, okay, right, guests are not really going anywhere. Um, let's save a bit of cash now instead of paying off loans. Because now we're making money, quite good money a month. So, what can we do in terms of Steel Coaster? Because that'll, that'll pull folks in. Um, let's see what we've got. So, Blue Surge... Double Dragon, Mantis. Can any of these fit anywhere? That's massive. Blue Surge is quite compact. What is wrong with this place? Why can't you build anywhere? Why can't you go at a funny angle either? <laughs> it's really annoying. Like that's quite clearly a good patch of land there. So maybe we could put here, and then that'll help the queues out for, we could do, you know, on the water, and then help the queues out for this blue surge thing. Yeah, it's not a bad shout. We'll pop that in, I think, at some point, whenever we get enough money, which could be never. Then again, how much do I need to pay off that other loan? Three grand. I don't know if it's worth paying that off first. Then maybe take that out. <laughs> I don't know. Is that stupid? Should I just not have paid these back? I mean, we are only paying this much back a month now. Yeah, we're doing that. I know this is so stupid, but. I'm going to pay that back, because that'll be quicker, in like two months. Take that loan out, put that coaster in, and then hopefully make enough money to pay back both of them. <laughs> this is so stupid. This is not how money works. Businesses surely don't do stuff like this. Um, ah, no, I don't care. It works, doesn't it? Um, whatever that's green, I'm happy, because that was touch and go. We were almost bankrupt there, folks. I think I remember that from the last episode. We might have almost bankrupt this park as well. Um... Yeah. Guess numbers just aren't going in, are they? They're really not. What we need is a bit of luck once I put this coaster in. And we could do with one of them busload of people turning up. That'd be really nice. I'd really like that. So then hopefully we can get like a busload of 50 and then get like 100 people in there just for the, uh, the new ride. That'd be nice. Come on, game. Help us out. Help a boy out. Oh, come on, you thing. One thousand pound left to pay off, and then we can put in a coaster. <laughs> oh, you can't say I don't try things, eh? You can't. You? At least we know it's going to see if it will work or not. I might have found a new little thing for you guys to try here. Really bad money advice. Don't just have one loan. Have two loans, then use a third loan to pay off everything else. Yay! I've not had much good, much history with loans in my personal life, I'll be honest with you, so I'm really not the best person to be <laughs> figuring this stuff. But we're almost there, come on, come on. All right, let's put this in, because as soon as it goes, we're doing it literally straight away. And then we've paid that off completely, and it's coaster time, and then hopefully that will do us. And then we have to figure out how to make people happy, that's going to be the fun bit after that. Um benches and cover I guess is the thing to do with that because it's just raining everywhere uh, right that's done take out loan yes 
Okay, let's put in that coaster. Steel coaster. But we've got seems to be blue surge. Here's the guy. And we're gonna put it there. So need to wait for a little bit more money. And that should hopefully go in. I can't see any reason why it wouldn't. It's not over the boundaries. I don't think. Um I guess we'll find out soon. Come on, money. Come on. Come on. And I really want this to up the people count in this park. So if it doesn't, we're going to struggle to do anything else, really, for this. Right, he's in. Okay, let's get it testing. Oh, no. Look what I've done with the water and the tunnels. Oh, never mind. Just have to go through tunnels. Yeah, this is going to eat people up. Look at this. Yeah, this is good. This is this is good. Right, let's get the exit path in. Okay, that's that's that, and then entrance queue line can just be this. There we go, and open. Okay. Is that going to bring people in? Please bring people in. I need to cover it up, actually, pavilions. That'll do. All right, right. Oh, they're coming in. Yes, people are coming in. Holy hell, they are. Okay, this is good. This is good. What are people saying? Hark, entrance deal is a good deal. Oh, I should have done that first. Yeah, this has got a much better capacity, this has. So I'm hoping now people go to this first instead of this. You see, there's my, there's my thinking. I'm trying to use my brain. I'm not I don't have don't have much, but I'm trying. Yeah, this is eating people. This is great. Um something more intense. Oh shut up. It's great. It's wonderful. Oh rain. Bloody rain. Start chipping down at these loans now as well. People just keep leaving. Why do they keep leaving? <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, is it because I have not enough benches? There's not, actually there is no benches up this path. That could be a, a reason. People love sitting down, don't they? Did that delete all the benches, or did they just not put a many in? Oh, there are a few actually. There's not many. Okay. Oh, right. Everything's back open. What are we doing then? So, 450, 60 guests. They're still coming in. They're still coming. Let's pay off. Loan, uh, under a thousand of that. These bring down all the monthly fees as well, which means my monthly profit will increase. Uh, your part will see a decrease in visitors. No, please, I don't, you don't need a decrease, you fools. Uh, should we do a press release thing? They don't ever seem to work, but we could try one. Um, should we just do a park advert? Let's do... How much would this cost us? 12 grand, absolutely no chance. Nope. Uh, attraction advertisement. Let's... Use this one, it's new. Three months bus stop. Uh, we can afford more than that. Radio advert. Go. These never work. 
I don't even know why I'm wasting my money on it. They never work. Okay, right, let's change this to thrill rides and pump the money up because they're the only things that bring people in. Let's get some thrill rides in the park, slap down a few random flats and, yeah, hope this works. I mean, what's our current thing you like? Okay, the happiness is going up. We are, we are slowly getting there. This is annoying me. This is really winding me up. Do I just get rid of some queue line? Like this and just... People will still come to it. If I just do that, then there's less queue. <laughs> because people are getting angry. That's the issue. People are angry in the queue. So if I do that, then it's harder for them to find. Which I don't think is a good thing. Oh, I don't know. Um, okay, there's a few people coming in. There's a few folks. The queue for this is really good. Look at that. It really does just go cut down straight away. Oh, bins. Okay, bench outside here. And bins. Where are you? It's a normal bin. There we go. What are you doing? Oh, are they watching it? Okay. Wonder what was happening. Right, let's look at listen to everyone's thoughts. What a cute raptor. Yay! They like it. They like the raptor. Let's go to 1050. Uh, pay off some more loan. Oh, actually, no, we'll keep that because we want to put a ride in, don't we? What is it? Move searching. G lock. Okay. So people are slowly still coming in. Look, this is good. This is good. What's our happiness rate at now? 80. We've hit that. That's good. So to keep that high, let's put in some more of these. Because these seem to like make people happy. There we go. Let's put another one up here. They seem to work. People seem to like them. Yeah, look, cute raptor. That helps. Um. Okay. We're teetering. We are teetering on the edge now. Uh, obviously, we've missed that goal of year two. That's fine. Do not worry. That is fine. Um, G lock. It might do it. The G lock could do this, and I think we'll probably put it in over here. Actually, no, it's quite busy that bottom end, isn't it? I should have probably extended the pathways out a bit in this park, but there. Eh, what are you gonna do, eh? What are you gonna do? Here. Yeah, it'll go here. That's a lovely bit of land there for it to go on. Or do we put it over here where there's not much? These trees. Yeah, up here is probably better. Yeah, it'll bring people to the back of the park, but still bring them in the park. Or at least that's the theory. I feel like that's been out of stock for absolutely god knows how long. Yeah, never mind. Not worrying about it. People aren't moaning, so that's good. Coffee is really worth the money. Okay. Really? Five dollars for a coffee? Well, actually, that's probably about the going rate for theme park food and drink. I mean, I think it's about oh, I don't know, four dollars fifty in Disney now for a cup of Coke. Which is ridiculous when you compare it to how much it actually costs to produce. But that's theme parks. Wow, we are, we're making some good money now. This park is actually quite profitable. Weirdly. I didn't think it would be. <laughs> Genuinely. When we got that bankruptcy notice and everything was red, I was not very enthusiastic. And, uh, yeah, I did not think this would happen. So, I'm happy. We've, we managed to fluff it with loans. So, yeah. I don't know whether that was luck or skill. I think it's luck more than anything. Genuinely, I think it's luck. Uh, but it's all good. Um, Blue Surge, 
effectiveness of 57. Okay, well, that's all right, I suppose. I, don't, I still don't think it did anything, but... Yeah, if you're telling me it did, I believe you. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm still getting over a bit of a cold. So I'm just going to pop in another Strepsil. Not sponsored by Strepsils, just saying. Okay, G-Lock. I'm going to keep that going on to the rise. Because we might need to put another one in after this to bring the last few in. That's that. <coughs> Pardon me, I am so sorry. Coughing in all your ears, that is awful. Put that there. Uh, Q there. And. Yeah, there's this one thing we'll just do with Q, I suppose. There we go. That's him. Uh, okay, so people coming in for that. Hopefully, we should have enough. It's slowly getting there. We're almost there. And we've done it. Yes, right. So, we need to keep this up for three weeks. Um, hopefully, the happiness thing will continue to stay there. Because that's the one that always gets me. Well, it's, it's pretty high. But it's teetering. I'd say that's teetering around 80. Um, oh, that's bringing absolute tons in. If anything, that's probably bringing more in than the bloody coasters. Yeah, the pathways really should have been bigger in this park. <laughs> but we've done it. Don't worry. It's fine. I just hope the happiness... Oh, great. So now bus is coming. Why couldn't you have come last when I needed you before? Wave swinger fans. God, that surely is the worst of all the enthusiasts. It's not coaster fans. Not thrill ride fans. Wave swingers. Yay. God. Well, at least we have one in the park. Uh, what's it researching next, just in case we need it? Oh, absolutely nothing. That's great. Cheers. Uh, okay, so 600 guests, that's absolutely fine. The happiness, I'm just hoping that stays up there. That's the only thing that's going to kill us. Come on, we've got a week to go. And all this money. I'm not even going to pay off the loans. Not even going to bother. What's the point? Absolutely no point of it. Um, I'm happy, though. I'm happy we've done this one. Uh, like I said before, I wasn't expecting to get this one done in this episode, so I'm quite happy about that. Then we can look at the next one now. Well, hopefully. Don't want to jump the gun. Still got a few days left. And quickly before the rain starts. Yay! We've done it! So we've got 500 guests in and a happiness rating of 80. Fantastic. Let's quickly save that. Done. Right then. Perfect. Let's look at the next one then. Let's move on. And let's see what that unlocks. <coughs> oh, there's movement. Oh, there's two. Is that a snowy one I see? What's that? 12 out of 10? What's that? Oh, well, I see. I've got to unlock them with 12. I get it. Right, so we've got... Uh, Biscayne Beach, I think it's how that's pronounced, no idea. A bustling beach city provides a strip of land for the development of a theme park under the condition that all rides have to be free. The winters can be rainy, but otherwise you can expect perfect beach weather. So that sounds quite a good one. Bit of uh, like a, a seaside town kind of uh, seafront beach -y theme park -y thing. Yeah. Have an experience rating of 80, 600 guests and a couple of optionals. That one sounds fun. What's the snowy one like? Let's have a look at this one. So this is Ice Shelf Islands. A small amount of land has become available in the frigid north and presents an opportunity for an amusement park. Brave the challenging weather and help your guests forget the cold. 550 guests, happiness of 75, and some optionals. Okay, brilliant. And then obviously the one we unleashed last time, unleashed, is uh, Batavia, uh, Batavia K, uh, which is probably the one we're going to do next time. Uh, but it looks quite hard. Have an experience rating of 80 and a thousand guests. So, yeah, that is the one actually I think we're going to have a look at. So, let's go into here and have a look, very, very, very quick look around. And as always in these uh, campaign episodes, we will start this in the next episode. So, let's have a look. So, this is where they come in on a lovely little um, dock. Is that where they come in? Or is that just my staff area? That's just my staff area, I think. Where do the guests come in then? Oh, here. Oh, look at the little boat. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, well done. Whoever put this one together, bloody well done. That's amazing. Okay, so we've got just a little entrance area. 
straight through a little boat. Oh, this is so pretty, this one. Really well done, this. Uh, oh, my Jesus, this is quite a big coaster. So it's like a dueling... What are they? Steel? Is that a steel coaster? Yeah, it looks like it. Wow, this is really nice. Uh, oh, God, it's not much space, though, is it? Holy hell. So we've got to get in a thousand guests into this place. Whew. Okay, this one is going to be a challenge. It really is. Wow, we might have to get rid of that ride. I don't even know what we can do here. Well, uh, that's definitely something we're going to look at next time. Uh, do we have any more land we can buy? Nope. Absolutely none. Bloody hell. Yeah, this one's going to be tricky. Okay, guys, so join us in the next episode as we try and figure something out with this one. Uh, Batavia K. Um, for now, guys, thank you ever so much for watching. I really do appreciate all the support. If you've enjoyed the video, please don't forget to give us a like down below and subscribe to the channel. Um, any questions, queries, comments, or suggestions, drop those down below. Fancy a chat, head on to Twitter or Discord. Links are in the description. And if you want to help us out, you can head over to our Patreon page. Um, all the links and information is down below. But for now, guys, thank you ever so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.